Many of us know someone who smokes cigarettes and that that can have serious impacts on our health. I'm making this vlog to share some real facts about the effects of smoking. Number one, nicotine, which is in cigarettes, has over 7,000 toxic chemicals in it that cause health deterioration through smoking. People who are smokers and experience any depression, stress, or anxiety will feel better after they quit smoking. Some people think mental health symptoms get worse if they quit smoking, but that's not true. Most people only suffer a few days of nicotine withdrawal before their symptoms resolve. And they start to feel better. Some people say, I'm old, it's too late for me to quit, and that's not true. Any time is the best time to quit. It doesn't matter if you're old or young. Once you quit, you'll start to notice some immediate health improvements, and continuing to be smoke-free will, for a long time will show drastic long-term health improvements. Around a few tens of thousands of people who have never smoked cigarettes die each year from breathing other people's cigarette smoke. This is called secondhand smoke inhalation. When children are exposed to secondhand smoke, it can cause bronchitis, pneumonia, asthma, ear infections, and more. If you or someone in your home is thinking about quitting but feels they're not ready, one first step is making sure that there are no cigarettes available at all in your home, car, or environment. If you are interested in reducing your smoking habits but don't know how to do it alone, here's a quick list of resources to support you. You can talk with your medical provider about nicotine replacement therapy, or NRT. There's our smoking cessation program, Breathe Well, Live Well, or BWLW. And you can call the New Hampshire Quit Smoking Hotline. And there are also many free apps you can download on your smartphone to help you reduce your smoking habits until you're ready to quit. Our goal is to have a healthier future together.